Hey, Megan here. I just want to share with you this product that I recently was sent by the company in exchange for my review. So let's go ahead and take it out of the box and put it together and I'll show you what it looks like. What we are going to be putting together today is a nine in one raised garden bed. Everything that you need to put this product together comes in the box. Uh, there are the rounded sheeting as well as the square panels. There's a set of gloves because these are sharp. Uh, and then you have all of the hardware that you need as well as the tools and then the rubber that goes around the top. Uh, so here's everything, the gloves, the panels, um, and then uh, also the posts that go in between. There are a variety of different shapes if you follow the instructions that you can create nine different ones. I today am just going to be using all the pieces to create the oblong eight foot by two foot by 1.4 foot garden bed. Each of these metal pieces has plastic sheeting. You wanna remove all of those. Once you do that, then you're ready to start putting the garden bed together. I'm going to start by assembling three of the square panels using all of the hardware provided. Uh, and then I'm going to be leaving a spot open in the middle and that is for the supports that go in between the two long panels. As you can see right here, these are the supports. So once I had both sides done, then it was time to go ahead and put the supports in there also using the provided hardware. The panels are made of a combination of zinc, magnesium, and aluminum coated steel. This combination really helps with sun protection, rain protection, and creates a windproof design. Compared to other garden beds that I have put together, this one definitely felt way sturdier. The sheeting was much thicker, yet still really easy to work with. Next, I created the end pieces using two of each of the rounded portions, and then once those are together, they're gonna go on the outside. After I had that side done and the supports in, it was time to do the end piece. Here is the completed bed. Next, I just am going to put the rubber top on here to keep it much sturdier and safer with this protective strip. Of the modern gray color, garden bed is great for vegetables, flowers, or herbs. Would really add aesthetic to any space. 